Today we're going to take another step towards eliminating the wheel hop of my 2018 Mustang by installing a set of IRS braces from Steeda. These Theta IRS subframe braces are going to fit all 2015 through 2018 Mustang Fastbacks. And the way they're going to work is they're basically going to bolt the frame to the subframe itself to add additional support structure and stop the subframe from moving. Movement in the subframe is one of the major causes of wheel hop. These are going to be a direct bolt-on installation, include all necessary hardware, and are made right here in the USA. For this installation, we a lift or a jack and jack stands, 3 8 ratchet, 15 millimeter socket, and a 10 millimeter Allen key. If you do have to move your subframe, you'll also need a 13mm and 21mm socket. Now the Cedar Brace is going to mount in three points. You're going to mount here, back here where the subframe bolts in, and then back here on the subframe itself. And the first step in the process is to remove this rear bolt. Before we can install the brace, you have to grab this threaded insert. What you're going to do is put this right up in here, you're just going to line it up. The bolt we install will pull down on that and hold to the back part of the brace. All right, now we're going to put the IRS brace up in the place where it's going to go and loosely start the front bolts. Now we'll grab the shorter bolt with the Allen head. I'm going to thread that into the plate we installed earlier. And now the longer bolt will go back here. And what you have to do is take this nut and basically put it on top of the subframe and then get it lined up so we can tighten it down. Now the last step is going to be the middle bolt here. Now on a good day, this will go up and line up with the thread on this plate. In our case, this plate's been off a couple times for other rear suspension upgrades, and it does not line up. If that's the case with your car, loosen these two 13s and this 21, and just shim it until it lines up. At this point, use a jack or a pole jack if you're on a lift. Lift it up enough to take the weight off of it so you can move it. Okay, now that all the bolts are started, we can go through and tighten everything down. Now, I do want to mention, once you have this bolt aligned and in place, you might not be able to get to the blue bolt to torque it. If that's the case, tighten these down here to hold it in place so it doesn't move. Pull the subframe brace off really quickly and then torque that bolt. This won't move and the bolt will still be lined up. We're going to torque everything now to Steeda supplied specs, torque the factory subframe bolts down, repeat the process on the other side and your installation is finished. The Steeda IRS subframe braces did an excellent job on my 2015 Mustang, and I know they're going to work great on my 2018 as well. Now again, these are fastback only. They will not fit your Mustang convertible, but as you saw, they're a pretty straightforward installation. It should take you no more than about an hour and a half or so. You'll be back on the road in no time.